Food Network recently said Grace Meat and 3 has the best fried chicken in Missouri. But Chef Rick Lewis also makes a mean meatloaf. Yeah, mean so loaf. we <laughs> twisted your arm, right, to give us all your secrets on, on how you do this? To yes, make this mean loaf? Yeah, that's Mean it. loaf. Okay, I have the <laughs> dirty job loaf. here. Yeah. Okay, what am I doing? So, uh, we start out with ground beef. We grind whole beefs at the restaurant. We add in these oats to kind of keep it uh, gluten-free and delicious. Some leeks. Oh, that's interesting. Crack some eggs. How many per pound did you say? Uh, let's see, I think this was like, it's like an egg per pound. Basically. Okay. Oh, so this is gonna be a big mean meatloaf. Big mean meatloaf. We add in some chopped herbs, so there's basil and parsley, some thyme, good. some salt. Should I be mixing already? Oh yeah, you oh, start okay. mixing. <laughs> Sorry. Get in there, start mixing anytime. Okay. Make sure the eggs get all busted up and nice. Okay. Here's some black pepper. Is there such thing as over mixing? So there's different opinions on that. Some people say don't mix very much so it's nice and tender. I do it more like a sausage. So we try to emulsify kind of everything in there. Okay. So we put in some soy sauce. Don't wear puffy sleeves if you're nope. making this. No puffy sleeves, some Worcestershire. Okay. I won't get you, don't, <laughs> don't worry. Some mustard, we make this in house at the restaurant. Okay. And a little bit of ketchup. And do the leaves they act almost like onions? Like what other exactly. people might use onions yeah, for? Yeah, okay. they kind of got a nice, uh, um, garlicky, mild onion flavor to them. Okay, so you put this in the oven for how long? After That's you a good question. Three, it. We do it in the Feel smoker okay. at 225, and it usually takes a couple hours, but you could form it and do it in the oven. I would say probably do it at a little higher heat, like 350. Do you make this into one loaf, or are you doing mini loaves? What do we do? So you want me to show you how we yeah, do it? Yeah, I do. Yeah, let me flip this guy here. Mm, so we would take that mixture, mm -hmm. Okay, why don't you turn it out right on here? I'm sorry, is that a, is a chef term? Yeah, turn it, <laughs> turn it out. Okay. So Dana, you know, we would typically mix this a little bit better. Okay. A little, little bit more mix. <laughs> like this. Uh -huh. Yeah. And so what we do to try to get like a nice round loaf is we would form it in parchment like this. Kind of oh. like you're rolling a giant sushi log or a cigar or something. <laughs> Whoa. And then we'd fold these over. That's amazing. And get it nice and uh, uniform like this. That wow. way you get that nice round shape like we have here. Before you start a fire here, what's happening? <laughs> I got it going. <laughs> so what we do after we cook the meatloaf is we uh, we cut it into portions and sear it to get a nice oh. crust on there. Can we, can we try this one? So that, yeah. that's Don't the catch secret in there. Oh, so it's not mushy. Okay, take a, take a bite for me. My hands okay. are, I got meatloaf hands here. If I have you to. Just pick the whole loaf up and, uh, and feed it today. Right. You can find this recipe after the show on YouTube. <laughs> this is smoking. Oh my gosh. Just search KCK News or the Five on Your Side app. Grace Meat and 3 is located in the Grove. You serve meatloaf what day of the week? Thursdays. How Thursdays. is it, Courtney? Oh my God, Dana, I have to feed this Okay. Too. If you haven't checked it out, go to his restaurant. Courtney's going to feed me here. Hold on. Yep. All right, we'll be back.